Father God, we worship your name today. What am I desiring? Because you are. Cause Pastor Sean, Taka Church has quickly become a cornerstone in the community, and people are curious. How did Taka Church come to be? What was the journey like for you? You know, the story of Taka Church is deeply personal for me. It wasn't just about starting another church. It was about responding to a call that I couldn't ignore. Uh, a few years ago, I found myself in this deep place of spiritual hunger. I had been serving in ministry for a very long time, but there was this persistent feeling uh, that something was missing, uh, something deeper, something more radical than what I had experienced uh, up to that point. So I began praying asking God for clarity, and slowly a vision started to take shape. It was a vision for a church that wasn't just a place to gather on Sundays, but a community that truly lived out the love of Christ in every aspect. A place where the doctrine of love wasn't just a sermon topic, but the very foundation of everything we did. Um, but it wasn't just about having a vision. There was this deep sense that God was mandating this, calling me to build a church that would be a living example of his love in the world that's hurting and desperate for real, authentic connection. And I'll be honest, it wasn't an easy road. There was plenty of moments where I was questioned whether I was up to the task, whether this was really what God wanted from me. But every time those doubts crept in, God met me in that space. He reassured me, gave me peace, and reminded me that this wasn't just about me, it was about his plan, his vision. And that's how Talk of Church was born. The Assembly of Christ Apostles, a place where love isn't just something we talk about on Sunday, but something we, try, we, we strive to embody every single day. It sounds like this journey has been both challenging and rewarding for you. How has this vision shaped the way Taka Church operates today? Absolutely, it's been both challenging and incredibly rewarding. The vision has shaped everything we do at Taka Church. We're uh, committed to loving God passionately, loving ourselves authentically, and uh, loving others unconditionally. That's the heartbeat of our community. It's about creating a space where people feel seen, heard, and loved, where they can come as they are and find healing and discover their purpose in Christ. So we're not just building a church, we're building a family. And that's something I'm deeply, deeply passionate about. Every time I see someone sign up to get more information or walk through the door for an interest meeting, it reaffirms why we're here and, and why this work matters so much. That's truly inspiring. What would you say to someone who's interested in learning more about Taka Church or becoming a part of this journey? I would say, come and see. Uh, we're hosting our next interest meeting on Saturday, September 7th at 10 o'clock a.m. It's a great opportunity to hear more about our vision, meet others who, who share your heart, and discover how you can be a part of something that's truly making a difference. Because this isn't just about building a church. It's about building a family grounded in the love of Christ and committed to making an impact in our community and beyond. If you've ever wondered if there's a place where you can truly belong, where your gifts and your heart can find a home, I believe Taka Church is that place. I love to meet you and hear your story and walk this journey with you. Thank you, Pastor Sean. It's clear that Taka Church is something special and we're excited to see how it continues to grow and impact the community. Thank you so much. I'm grateful to be a part of it and see what God is doing through this church. I can't wait to see, I really, I can't wait to see what's next. You are the all-consuming fire